Hey, what's going on, gentlemen? Welcome to another episode of the Onward Mint Podcast. My name is Richard Muchka, and I am the founder of this podcast. And today, guys, is Wednesday. And it's something that I call Marriage Wednesday. And just to let you know, gentlemen, this podcast is built for men, right? For men that want to get better, for men that want to grow, for men that want to dominate life in the five M's of manhood, which are money, mission, muscles, mindset, and marriage. And I believe, guys, that you got to have all five if you want to be considered a high-performance man. And guys, I want to take the time really quick to thank all of you that are watching this, that are listening to this podcast, that are leveling up your life as a man, because it's our vision, it's our mission here at Onward Men to help men get better. And we believe that when men get better, everything gets better, guys. And I know what it feels like to be stuck in life. I know what it feels like to not have passion and purpose in what I am doing, guys. And I want that for you. I want that for you so bad. I want men to win. And with that being said, guys, today is Marriage Wednesday. And us as men have great responsibilities to lead our marriage, right? It's not easy. Obviously, everything that is worth it is generally not easy, uh, but it's worth it, right? And anything worth doing is worth doing well. And in your marriage, guys, you better step up. You better get better. And it's something that it's a mantra that I tell myself because every day, guys, I fail as a man. There's no doubt about it. I have goals, aspirations, dreams within our marriage, things that I want to do within our marriage, and I don't hit them, right? Every day I fail at that, but I try to get better, and I try to go to that prize. I try to hit that prize at the end of the day to say, man, I did what I needed to do in order to have a thriving marriage, in order to be there for my wife, in order to to build that relationship with my wife. And for some of you men, Well, for all of us, one thing that we all want more is because we're men is sex, right? How do we have more sex in our marriage? And guys, something that is staggering in my opinion is that the first basic need for a man, for every man, is sex. That is a basic human need for a man. But what I find fascinating, guys, if you look at your spouse, if you look at your wife, The first basic need for them is affection, right? Not sex. If you look at the second basic need for a man, it is recreational companionship. If you look at the second need for a woman, it is communication and and talking and connecting, right? So guys, nowhere for a female is their basic need sex. But for a man, that is the number one need that we want as men. So how do we get more of that in our relationship? How do we take our sexual game to the next level, right? Because in marriage, guys, obviously sex is important. Sex is is something vital, especially to a man, because that's how we get a lot of our, um, our, 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 uh, our worth out of our marriage, right? It's just the way God created us. But gentlemen, Something that I know about most marriages is that most men say that they're not getting enough sex. They want more sex. They want more sex. But I'm here to tell you that it comes down to needs, gentlemen. When your wife has her needs met, she is more likely to meet yours. In fact, it's just how it goes. You meet your wife's needs, then she will meet yours. It's how the game is played. So gentlemen, I want to let you know that your wife's number one need right now is affection. So are you showing your wife affection on a daily basis? I mean, that's the question, guys. If you want your number one need met, which is sex, you've got to meet the need theirs first, which is affection. How do you show affection in your marriage? Are you loving to your wife? Are you showing affection in terms of a connection and touch to your wife? How do you do that on a consistent basis? How do you show her that you are interested in providing that need for her? Because the more that you do that, the more you will have your need of sex met on a regular basis. Same thing with our number two need, guys, which is connection and communication, right? If you can meet that second need and that first need, 
which is affection, you will get so much more sex out of your marriage, it'll be retarded, it will be ridiculous, simply because you are able now to meet her needs as your wife. And guys, this is something that I find very, very, I'm very passionate about, and I believe to be so freaking true, it's not even funny, right? It comes down to needs, guys, and you must know your wife's needs, you must know what she wants, you must know how to meet those needs, and you must do it consistently. If you want any need of yours met consistently, you want more sex consistently, then meet her needs consistently, and you will have more sex. It's how the game is played. And I wanna share that with you today, guys, because I know Know that sex is so important to us. I know uh, you know how sex is so important to you and it's okay to say it. It's okay to talk about it because it's such an important part of the marriage, especially for the male guys. And I want you to have more sex, to be honest. I want you to have more uh, pleasure in the bedroom, right? That is a good thing. And with that being said, guys, I hope that this podcast uh, <clears throat> helped you today, right? Kind of opens your mind to okay, hey, you know what? These are my two the my two wife's first needs are affection and then connection and communication. I need to hit those every day. I need to have a game plan to hit those every day, and then voila, I will have more of my needs met as a man. And that is my message today, gentlemen. Of course, like always, if you are a man that likes to help others, if you find any value in this podcast, then gentlemen, please share it. Please leave a review, leave a five-star review and let other men know that, hey man, the Onward Men podcast is about men. It's going to help you get better. And one life at a time, gentlemen, I think we can change the landscape of this world. And that is our vision and that is our mission here at Onward Men. So guys, dominate your Wednesday, leave a review, make sure to tell others, and also you can go to richamuchka.com for sales, influence, and persuasion. You can also go to the onwardmenpodcast.com for every manly episode of this podcast. We are out for now, guys. Peace.